Yeah, we, we um, we're installing seat posts between the thwart and the keelson to stiffen up the boat to communicate more of the stresses that the ribs and stringers have been handling by themselves, communicate more of those stresses to the gunnels, which are the main structural element to the boat. And so what we've done is I've measured these and I'll maybe do a video later how I measured them with a, with a story stick rather than trusting on a, on a measuring tape or a, or a, a um, yardstick because you get the problem when you're measuring, you get a problem with parallax that you have to be looking at right angles to the measurement because the, the width of a saw blade, a 64th of an inch, makes a difference between fitting and not fitting as we can see with that post at the end there. We're going to install a crafty cheeky wee shim there and claim that that was what we intended to do. Um, but in any case, so I've, we've done a lashing between the post and the keelson and at the top we will drill and put in a couple of pegs so that because the important thing is that it has a little bit of motion it, it can flex a little bit so this the pegs will will keep this oriented fore and aft although we could we could do the almost the same effect by doing a lashing up here as well but we've lashed as you can see a v and then by passing a number of half hitches this is called a y lashing it tightens the lashing up by shortening the angle or changing the angle shortening increasing of the uh, of the V so we're we hand tightened it as much as can and now we're sweating it making it tighter still by tightening it like that but yeah that's good and I'm just gonna finish with an overhand knot and then later on we'll cut off short this by the way is tarred nylon halibut line and they I don't know what the breaking strain is but far more than my body weight as we can see <laughs> so yeah let's uh, it's gonna be interesting it's gonna be fascinating to see how this changes it's the feel of the boat when it's on the water and also because we want to uh, strengthen it so it doesn't hog when we put it on the two wheel of the, the dolly and I've just about run out of things to talk about get out <laughs> I, I know it's impossible as to say why don't you talk about the weather it's uh it's fair to look at <sighs> It's, it's what the Irish would call a soft day in that it's, uh, yeah, the atmospheric humidity is about 110%. So it's, uh, it's misty and there's a, there's a slight, it's not hard enough to be really annoying, but it's just enough to make my glasses all manky so I can't see properly. <laughs> Lovely.